Greetings and salutations, folks. My name is Nick, and welcome back to Clive Barker's Jericho, where last time we entered the time of the Templars. Uh, because every area in this game is separated by, like, sections frozen in time. We went to an area where uh, the Allies were still fighting the Nazis. Now we went to an area where the Templars were still uh, on their mission, on their Inquisition of sorts. And it turns out they have, after a, an eternity of battle, convinced themselves that the demons are angels. Which is some very Jacob's Ladder shit. If you've ever seen the movie Jacob's Ladder, like... Like, that, that's got a pretty similar vibe to that sort of thing. The entire idea of, like, the angels only appear as demons, or the demons appearing as angels. Um, we are almost to the end of the Templar run, largely because I... It's like, okay, I, I don't really look at walkthroughs don't touch me. Uh, to Let see me what I'm supposed you. to do I unless I get God, really, really, me. really, 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 really stuck. Everyone stay back! Um, what the hell happened to you guys? The children, my but I always look so just to see how so long a game is. They wanted us to suffer as much as they suffered. It's like and yeah, this is the last area inside. of the Templar I zone. The worst of it. We move you on to the next problems. era of time of being touched. involving the Romans. Let me talk to her. Don't talk to me. It's okay, Simone. I find this scene interesting because it's like. Was that what you called it? Like, it presents the idea that these characters do, in fact, have depth. That they do, in fact, have history. Like, they actually have history with each other. They have some sort of understanding with each other. Internal backstory. But we never really see this backstory until it gets brought up un until situations like this. So you spend most of these do do, the, the game not really the knowing anything about them. It's kind of like we could just work on the bed wedding. Did you make a good comparison to to oh, this yeah. situation specifically? Meeting. They think Arnold Legion um, is flying circus or the whole would be Sarah like in Avengers Age of Ultron when the, um Scarlet find the next breach and get the hell out when Black there. Widow was suddenly able to just calm down the Hulk. Despite the fact that we've never seen that in any of the previous movies. Hmm. I was gonna say, is this the best choice against these enemies? Like, this is... Oh my gosh. Like this is my favorite character to use. I'm sorry, sir. I won't let it happen again. Ah. <laughs> Jesus Christ on a crutch. Use the possession interface by possess pressing and holding to switch to Cole, Team Alpha. Firestorm. Paradox established. The team's attacks now have additional fire damage. Press L1 again to deactivate Firestorm before Cole loses contact with reality. What does that even mean? Like, I'm... I'm, gl I'm glad you have these interesting... Uh descriptions of your abilities that probably make a lot more sense in lore as opposed to like functionality wise they're aesthetically purposeful but like it's always important the player understands what the hell you're talking about hold on let's switch to Cole Paradox established. what happens if once you lose grip on reality we just started playing. The worst that can happen is she dies.
We can see how long this takes. Hold on. Did nothing happen? Establishing temporal loop. Nothing happened. I spent all this time worrying that something was going to happen. Because the game said it'll... It'll maintain itself until she loses her grip on reality? But in fact, nothing happened. The, okay, that's fine. That's a feature, not a bug. Uh, we'll, we'll enjoy our freedom of fire damage bonuses and time slowing uh, to our heart's content. Uh, but first, we fight this boss. Have you come to confess your sins, who has become kind of alien-esque. How dare you defile this holy place and make demands, heretic! You reek of sin! Kneel before me and be cleansed! What's he saying? Same shit they told me when I was expelled from Catholic school. And I'm gonna give him the same answer. Huh. Are they attacking Malthus? Well, they, I'm pretty sure they're probably upset for being led to their deaths. That, that was the button I wanted. No. Oh, did everybody die? Who am I playing as? Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. Oh my gosh, why is everybody down? Uh, okay, you're getting back up. And you... Unfortunately, there's no run button, as the run button has not been invented yet. I can do both at the same time, right? Let's switch to black. Let's wait until he does the explosion thing. That seems like the time that he's supposed to be vulnerable. Wrong button. Oh, son of a... <sighs> was there at least a checkpoint in between the beginning of the level? No, there wasn't a checkpoint. Does this mean I have to be stuck watching that whole intro cutscene again? Fight that initial fight as well? <sighs> if you're making a game and you have checkpoints, 
And there's... Oh, thank goodness, this is a skippable. Okay, but I still have to do all the other stuff. I wonder if I could just start the fight right now. Nope, never mind. Alright, I'm going to try to keep at least one person... ...over here. That way, at the very least, this place is a little bit easier to defend if he, when he does his explosion attack, which seems to kill everybody in, in his line of sight in one hit. Okay. Ah. Get you. Okay, so maybe what I should do is I should stand kind of over here. Or... Nope. Okay. That seemed like it was good. Like, as long as I keep him over here... And then he's going to eventually, like, push the kids away. Then go towards me. And then rise. Explode. I'm gonna hope that just ducking is fine. Like that! Right in your vulnerable face! Okay, so now he got the kids. And now he'll rise. Explode. Nope. All right. I don't think they're listening. I loved you. I loved you all. You are my children. My sweet. You led them to be murdered terribly. They all suffered horribly because of your decisions. Like the road of t in good, the road to hell was led by your good intentions. Yep, let's get out of here. Yeah. And there's the portal. Fantastic. The dead suffer endless pain as they hang tortured from crucifixes. The Jericho team make their way through the fields of tortured souls to seek out Cassus Vicus. How do we know we're seeking out this... this, this person? Are we already aware of the shifts... Like, uh, there's a lot of the way that the storyline is presented. Like, the intro to the storyline is like, there's the firstborn, and the firstborn is the entity who's going to destroy everything. 
But like three missions later, Ross is like, who's the firstborn? Huh? I don't, I don't know. I think it's safe to say we're now under Roman rule. Could be worse. At least the Romans were civilized. Oh yeah, they were real civil. I mean, besides the crucifixions and the gladiatorial exhibitions, the slavery. And let's not forget that unfortunate incident with Christ. We are, technically speaking, chaplains. Well, you're the historian, Jones. What can you tell us about this place? Well, if Simone could get me to fix on the year. First century, sir. 38 AD. 38 AD? Wow, are you sure? <laughs> Never mind, of course you are. That means it's the reign of, uh, let's see, Caligula. Yeah. How'd you know that? God okay, Caligula, I want to say, is relatively famous uh, for killing a lot of people. I want really to say. It's been a while. Land, basically. I mean, if I was a Roman centurion and I was sent to garrison Alcali, it would have been like exile. Alcali is about as far from Roman law as you can get. With Emperor Caligula on the throne, I think that's a good thing, don't you? We need to keep moving. Stick to the road. You keep an eye out for Leech and his men. Also, even though the Roman area has some, like, Roman-specific inspired things, it is j actually like that is that is actually really really good like it's not just a crucifixion it's like the skin pulled back from from his arms and face nailed to the cross like that's good stuff that's some that's some some good Clive Barker some Italian fingers Clive Barker but everything is still so washed out and gray and desaturated. It's disappointing to, to look at this and not be able to appreciate just how disgusting this could be. Do you hear that? It's like the walls are talking. Come Why, hello. Are you going to shoot or do you want me to shoot first? Ha <laughs> ha Damage Trebek. This one's mine. Is it? Alright. You win this round, shield guy. Ah. There we go. No. Nope. We're now scoping it. Excellent. Okay, this is going to be tricky if I'm going to have to deal with a lot of guys with shields. Yeah, if they shoot him in the back while looking at me, you know, that that's not a bad idea. Like, they're not smart enough to figure out how to take cover while trying to decide if they want to, which aggro they want to be pulled by. This isn't, um, Army of Two. Delgado needed to interact because he has the power to lift gates with his gloved hands. And you know, to be fair, that's what I would sound like if I was lifting a giant iron gate. 
So, you know, you, you win this one, Delgado. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, nope, you're still alive. I'm sure she's fine. No, no. Ah, no. Damn it. Alright. Oh my gosh. These guys are the worst. Alright, let's try to do a little bit better. Err on the side of caution. Don't worry about reviving people because there's going to be a lot of these explodey guys. Okay, that doesn't help. Nope, that's not the staircase. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I'm aware of this. There we go. Okay, I really need to revive one person at least. Damn it. Damn it. No. Is this like an infinitely spawning or just a lot of guys? Because it's hard to tell sometimes. I want to say like it's just a lot of the same bad guy over and over again. And a very unfortunate position. Maybe I could get everybody to stop moving at the top of the staircase. Okay, so what I might be able to do... Stay here. is get them to stay up top here, attract the fight, and then maybe we'll be relatively safe. Ah, son of a... I keep missing these attacks. No, don't, don't go forward. Stop going forward, you stupid. I mean, I don't know what I was expecting, really. Yeah, I suppose your system's okay. Finally, hit something. No, stop. 
No, that's the wrong button. Oh my gosh. You were standing just a second ago. Nope. Stop trying to move forward. There's a reason I am giving you these orders. I survived that. Excellent. Unfortunately, no special ammunition. All right, last of the special ammunition for... Good enough. You can explode over there. Excellent. Alright, I'm going to need to switch to... Delgado, maybe. What is his... Oh, it's just a pistol. Alright, let's hope for a resupply soon. So that we can overcome this gauntlet. Thank goodness. We've escaped also the terrible music. Oh, hello. No, Delgado! Stop. All right, that worked. By the grace of God. <laughs> he he can be too much every once in a while. Oh, hello. Oh, thank goodness. I I thought I was about to hit Jones. Okay, where are the other targets? Oh, it's one of those. You know those science fiction, like, usually the older, cheesier science fiction shows or movies, where you see, like, like tons of lasers flying everywhere? Like, I feel like... That actually worked pretty well. 
I feel like that's what it looks like when your side is shooting bullets at somebody. Is it there's just so many bullets? That's one of these guys again. I guess they can't all be unique villains. Might as well recycle some of them. For some reason, the top one seems relatively difficult to hit. Oh, never mind, that's why. Because we're doing this again. But I mean, if, if you've got one bespoke animation and it's, it's complicated, you might as well do it twice. And like it, and you spent the money making the one big boss. Might as well have you fight them. Let's see, this would be the fourth time I fought this one. Yeah, might as well fight it four times. What was he defending even? Oh, just this path probably. It's one of the Romans. You. What's your name? Mano suas imponat id lingua eus dica. I think he wants to communicate through Jones. H how do we know he's on our side? Yeah, fuck that. Don't do it, man. It's all right. Of course, if it looks like I'm in trouble. He's toast. Somebody help him. No, wait. You, you have, have come, come for the firstborn, firstborn, correct? We have. Who are you? I am Tertius Longus, Interesting how the, last of seven the Templars spoke English, the world from the wrath of the first but the Centaurians didn't. Do you seek the secret of the Pyxis? We do. Tell us what you know. Hidden here, among the guards of the depraved governor, Vicus Cassus, we watched as he turned Al-Kali into a carnival of decadence and depravity. The firstborn had enticed Vicus to open the breach, and while it busied itself with fresh meat, my brothers and I traveled deep into the Pyxis to perform the rites to collapse the breach. Fresh the same meat. Knowledge. The breach has been opened again. Tell us what to do. You realize the price you pay for coming here? We do. No! Bullshit! There has to be another way! The cycle will continue until the firstborn possesses that which its creator refused to give it. That which mankind takes for granted! Freedom. Wait, what about the pro what about the prophecy the of the seven of times? Just as evil is the absence of love. I don't understand. If not freedom, what does the firstborn want? We have nothing to give it. Then the cycle will continue. Jones, get out of there. Let go. How do we break the cycle? What does the firstborn want? God damn it! Do something. Vicus, you seek Vicus. He alone can open the breach that leads to the heart of the Pyxis! Jones, break the link! You have to let go! Where? Where do we find Vakis? He's dying! Damn you, let him go! Follow the waters! Find the waters and you find the breach! Enough already! 
Don't do anything that stupid again. Ugh, that was worse than having Ross in my head. No offense. I don't see any water around here. What did he mean? An aqueduct, maybe? I doubt it. The only water you're likely to find out here will be under the ground in a well or a bath. Or a river of blood. I'm hoping this is not backwards. Both tunnels looked kind of the same. Okay, this one seems to be stretching a little bit further than the previous one did. Hello. You got any more? Yeah. And is there a coliseum in the distance? Do I spy? There's another one. Ross, company. I see. No, not coal. Like Alright, let's switch to black. Oh, there's uh, one of these guys. Alright, pick you up. You up. Pick up Rawlings. Pick up Jones. Oh, already dead by that point. Excellent, that's fine. Come on, you sack of shit. Huh. Ah. There we go. I got it. Yes. Oh no, these guys. Okay, let's pick... Oh, no. Delgado was already being picked up by Rawlings, who seems to be the only... You're in the Roman time period for some reason. Alright. Oh 
There we go. Stop. I got you. Thanks, Padre. All right. That was a little bit of a struggle, that level. The suffering of Tertius Lung. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. The names in this game are so stupid. Like, we already dealt with somebody who is... We already had to read the words. Um, Pope Innocent. Um, <laughs> I got this. The suffering of Tertius Longanus has lasted 3,000 years and will continue for eternity until someone hands him over to the firstborn to get to Cassus Vicus. The team must gain passage into the corrupt city through the baths. The Caldarium awaits. All right. Not only are, is this uh, highly desaturated, but like also hard to, yeah. to look at. We needed a little bit of what do you think, Frank? Can you make it through there? Who's Frank? Which which one is Frank? Oh. Delgado is incapacitated, sir. Was I expected to put on the fire defense shield? The game's never really properly explained any of its abilities. The uses of the what's like it, like it it, it kind of like it gives you one demonstration and is like you're good. Okay, is that good enough? Hello. Okay, which way did I come from? This is what you've been waiting for. Ah. Son of a See and the and that brings back to the main one of the main problems in this game is everybody's health is so low this is like normal difficulty and one hit from a lot of attacks kills you which like i i can kind of guess what they were thinking and that is like you're in a squad so if you're it like shit and death in there 
Like, if one person gets knocked down, you've still got, like, five other... Uh, people to keep going. But, well, for one, it doesn't necessarily work very well when you've got yourself separated from the rest of the squad and there's nobody to pick you up. Yeah, I'm, d I'm just gonna keep going. I don't need to... I don't need to fight you. There we go. There we go. Or I guess I do need to fight you. And then the other being the fact that you spend, like, most of your time resurrecting people. Which is not a good time. At least I'm getting checkpoints. Why, why have I lost my ability? What has happened to it? Where, <laughs> where am I going? That's right, you keep that. Come out and play. Ah, no, no. Oh, you, you jerk. Oh, thank goodness. I forgot. About, I almost forgot about the uh, checkpoints. No, I did forget about the checkpoints. Uh, I was, I was for a moment there. I was so concerned that I'd have to go back to the beginning of the level. Where am I going, by the way? It's unclear. Okay, but this looks familiar, and the music has decided uh, it doesn't want to be as action-packed. Ah, uh, here we go. There, there's the ending. Yes! No, but we're not done yet. Oh, no, no, oh the, shoot. I was like, whew. I guess we are, we are done with that part. All right, let's, let's, let's carry on. I got temporarily distracted by a bug. The unfortunate part of living 
in Florida is that, like, on one hand, it's got generally nice weather. On the other hand, there are many more bugs. Many more types of bugs that I had never seen before. Uh, coming to this place have revealed themselves. Actually, Delgado's not so bad. You know, maybe that's what I needed, is... This is what you've been waiting for. Like, I, like, what I needed isn't uh, separations from the team. What I needed is, like, levels where I'm specifically required to play as one specific character so that I could learn their movesets. Because Delgado's actually kind of awesome. How, how long is this going, though? It's not like I have anywhere to go with my life. But... We are already there. And also, his fire demon uses no ammo as well, which is convenient. This is what you've been for. Or, like, am I- is the game actually just expecting me to keep going? Like, if I just keep going here... By the grace of God. Will I be able to... Actually going somewhere in this area? Like now that I've got my team together. This is what you've been waiting for. Like I guess I'm going backwards kind of. Ah. Sure you were. I think I owe you one. Oh, okay. Thank goodness. Oof. I, I, w I was worried that I was getting lost and the ending was not in sight. The decadent culture of the inhabitants has transformed the baths into a repulsive torture chamber. Pools of vomit, baths of blood and excrement complement the torture and sadomasochism. The only... <laughs> like, if, if only you could actually see any of these colors, because, um... Of all the... The grayed out. Maybe maybe we're better off not seeing all the colors. Actually, no wait. Doom 2016 and Doom Eternal Do proved otherwise. That's all of them. 
I mean, without saturation and color, this just looks like a regular gray hall with muddy floors and occasional body parts sticking out of the floors. Is this... Ah, that's actually not a bad strategy. If I've got, like, um, the slow motion bullet and... Available, should I say. I could just do, like, a one-two punch. There we go done ah very rude I know, he works out all the time. Excellent. Ah. And then there's that guy, just like way over there, slowly making his way towards us, okay. That. Ah, not good enough. Like, what, what, what is that? Like, that's a choice. There we go. Yes, keep the checkpoints coming. Amen. I know! Okay, now what are we supposed to do? Where are we supposed to go? What are we s- Get again. Jones. Oh, Get yep. Closer. All right. Ross? This is interesting. Aha! Ma'am. Ah. What did I tell you about the hyperbole? He's shredded. Everyone okay? I mean... I think we're doing fine. Oh yeah, we passed by this fella. 
Are we gonna actually fight this thing, or is this just really sick network is still down, sir. Uh, concept art? Like, is this gonna be the villain of uh, the Roman territory, bloated on the the corpses of those that he had feasted upon? Hmm. I'm guessing the answer is yes, considering that statue. Okay. Delgado. Where are you, Delgado? Thanks. A lot of history in these walls. Meathead inbound. Targets in range. All right, let's hide behind this column. Ah. I wonder if I could slow down. I know I could speed up. Ah, uh, did that actually- okay, excellent, good. Excellent. Hostiles inbound. Yes, the hostiles are us. I mean, we've been trapped for quite a while. That felt good. Like, how many bad guys? Up oh, there we go. I was going to say, it doesn't really seem like we're fighting that many goons. Ah. Ah, all right, this looks like progress. So much history on the walls, but it barely stands out at the desaturated colors. Um, oh yeah, flashlight. I almost- I, I always forget that you have one of these things. The Temple of Pain! What should I try to do? Should I try, try to do like a Macho Man Randy Savage? Be like, Oh yeah! The Temple of Pain! Vicus luxurious palace lies between the villa and a fortress designed to the twisted taste of its owner. He has transformed the old temple that was once dedicated to the classical deities into his own personal hell. Then the temple of pain. I don't know if that was necessarily a good macho man. Let me know. I will switch from Jones to Black. As she is still my favorite.
Alright. Alright, that was a good run. Hello? Alright, it technically works with regular shots, but it's just harder to do. Well, that wasn't actually that bad. Really? I'm confused. Architecture is impressive, but I didn't expect it to be this bloody. You didn't expect this layer of hell to be this bloody. Right. Ah. Okay, we got one of two. There we go. Oh, hello. I wasn't sure if that would actually do anything. Ah. Did such I I thought the welcoming committee gave it away Something's coming, sir. Something very angry. oh hello let's, let's back Ooh. it up damn it giant target still somehow miss somehow missed again there we go. Ow. You know, if I distract him and everybody's able to just keep shooting him relentlessly... Like, that that's fine by me. I'm, I'm hoping this is technically working. And they're not just shooting their shots for nothing. Or I just need to shoot something at your back. Nah. Let's hope this dodges fast enough. Okay, that's good. Like, I might have to switch who I'm using just so I can get a decent shot at this guy. Ah. 
All right, let's let's bring him back towards the group. Um, let's switch to Rawlings. Now let's switch to Delgado. Now let's switch to Rawlings. All right. Oh, you think you have a chance somehow after all of that? There's one. Yeah, one second. Ah, I tried my best. Excellent. Is there such a thing as pro strats for uh, Clive Barker's Jericho? I think I've discovered my own pro strats for Clive Barker's Jericho. Is anyone hurt? Does this game even have a cult following? Yeah, it's just the statue of big guy. Consuming, eating upon the flesh of the innocent. Okay, we're... Alright, seems like I'm gonna have to use Jones. Oh. Okay, I need... I need you to stand on the pressure plate. Can you please... What am I looking for? I have... No idea what I'm expected to do. I know that there are these buttons. And that I cannot seem to get people to stand on these pressure plates. Like, I'm hoping that's not the case.
because, yeah, once I switch bodies... Who's hurt? Like Joan, the, the the clue seems to be with Jones. But How? Okay, I think I'm gonna have to look this one up, hope for the best, find a, find a walkthrough because... This is not very clear. Okay, so apparently there's a leather a lever that I've been... ...not paying attention. Like, I think I've been trying to look at it. There we go. Okay, now that I've gotten that lever. I think that was that. Ah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> God damn. There we go. Okay, and now that there... The path to the left seems to be a viable option, Church. I was gonna say... Alright, let's switch to Church. Hopefully this is gonna be easy. That was a viable option. Okay, now will I'm people not detecting any curses or traps, sir? The floor mechanism appears safe. The marks on the floor say we should stand on these. Question is, do we trust them? Everyone stop. Oh, I, I can't actually switch to anybody. spread out and stand on each tile. Thank goodness, finally. But how do I switch back? Move out. Yeah, okay. Are you going to do it automatically or Omega team, advance. That. There we go, finally. Advance. Yes, sir. Hmm. 
Okay. There we go. There's progress. The gardens are lavishly decorated with fountains and statues. The surroundings look impeccably beautiful, but with vicious touch of sadism. Oh, uh, I like what you've done with this place, but did you really need so many dead bodies on the floors and dead bodies on the walls? All right, I'm going to stop here for the night. Got any suggestions for someone to play next? Leave them down in the comments below. Don't forget to like and subscribe and have yourselves a good night.